Hello, I'm just going to go through the Anki add-ons I use for my A-levels. This is the video I wish I had. I'm going to put all the codes for the add-ons in the description that you can just add it really quickly. So let's get into this. Um, so the first one is called a heat map. Um, it allows you to see how many reviews you've done each day in the previous days and how many is going to come up as well. And um, this is amazing because it keeps you accountable and sees if you're being lazy. The second one is to do with countdown to events and exams. So this one's great because you can put all your A-level exams, subtests, topic tests, any tests that you've got coming up, and it keeps you um, in your mind whilst you're reviewing and about to review it. Um, third one is one where it hides pieces of an image and then you can make that flashcard. This is so important and it really helped me. This picture here, you're seeing this is um, space repetition. This is what Anki uses, it's called space repetition. So it means that every time you repeat it, you remember it for a longer period of time. And Anki has built this concept into it and it helps you be able to memorize something with lesser effort. And um, it will help you in the future. If you start in year 12, by year 13, you're gonna be laughing. Okay, the fourth type of um, add-on I used, which was this edit and review. So basically you have to go into the, um, the browser section, go into the card that you use, and you're gonna put edit in front of these things here that I'm pointing out. Um, you'll see why this is useful in a minute. Um, then you're gonna restart the application, and then you're gonna type you can go into your flashcards and you can edit it whilst you're reviewing it. This is so invaluable because one, it saves time because when you make your own flashcards or if you're gonna use mine that are in the link to, in the description, it just really helps and um, saves a lot of time, especially when you're gonna spend a lot of your time using this, hopefully after using this video. Okay, now the fifth um, add-on that I used was Speed Focus. You can go into this, you have to shift click option and then go to general, and then you can um, edit this these panels here. So what this does is that it basically flips a flashcard for you so you can sit back and you can let it do it for you. So it's fucking, it's amazing, it's brilliant. It's, it's much better than using uh, yourself, and it helps a lot. Um, and then the last one is, this one's about speech, add speech into your flashcard. Um, this is so helpful for me because one, I'm dyslexic and it helps me actually be able to pronounce a word that I didn't know in chemistry, for example, because sometimes it's really hard to know what something is pronounced like. Obviously, I know how to pronounce my name, but um, it's much different when you're talking about something called bipyramidal. Um, so that's the add-ons I use for my A-levels. I hope they help you and thank you very much.